Hello everyone, I'm back with another vlogmas video. It is the last day of November, which I'm very excited about because November is my least favorite month and I love December. I just had my lunch and now I'm off for a walk with Benji and Billy and my mom and my grandma. And when I come back, I think there will be some baking going on, so stay tuned. Such excitement! Walkies! I need to show you something, guys, because this is the most hilarious thing on earth. This is the bag we use to transport Billy. And he just goes inside. Just see. Billy, grandma! Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> See, no problem whatsoever. <laughs> All set. Billy's here. Benji's here. <coughs> My hat is on too. So let's go. Come on, Mash. What do you have? Do you have a stick that's almost bigger than you? <laughs> we brought some apples for the horses. There he goes. His name is Igor. He's a bit feisty. <laughs> Christmas puked all over Katya today. Ready to bake? Yes. Prosciutto rolls? Prosciutto rolls? <laughs> She'll be speaking in Slovene and I'll be translating because I can't be bothered to put the subtitles on because it's a lot of work, okay? We have two blocks of this not the stool. puff pastry, <laughs> some prosciutto, <laughs> and we also need eggs. How many? <laughs> <laughs> we shall see <laughs> where the night takes us and it's literally 3 p.m. girl. <laughs> this dough is already rolled out. If it's not, you obviously need to roll it out. So you get like a very thin piece. We're gonna put the prosciutto on top of the yeah, on top of the dough. Are you making this for the first time? No, okay, I forgot. Yeah, so you just put prosciutto on top of the rolled out dough. Cheese do roll. Yeah, cover the whole thing. Yes. And now, now we roll. Today, yaitsa. Ne vem si cerkuk i bomo rabe ubijemo. Okay. Into this mesh, I'm on. You need a fork. Rock them. No, they don't. You're savage. You <laughs> <laughs> what the hell, Katya? <laughs> <laughs> you basically then take, I would say, one centimeter each. You just cut it sideways so that you get like a little nice roll and you do that until you're done. I would say less than a centimeter. But yeah, less than a centimeter. You just put them on the baking tray. I use this um, silicon thingy instead of uh, baking paper. Are you helping out? Or just waiting for something to fall down? You just spread some egg on top of them. Then you just put them in the oven, bake them on 180 degrees for how long? We'll see. 10 minutes I don't know. ish? Okay. Something like that. Ooh la la! They're done. Mm. Quality control. <laughs> They're very doughy though this year. Because mm -hmm. the dough is like a lot thicker, like even the rolls themselves. They used to be like a lot smaller. Who wants to come over? And another transformation. <laughs> Why are you dressed so nicely? I'm going to the trampoline park. <laughs> sure you are. I'm going to a dance thing. Yeah. It's mainly for older people, but you know, you can never miss a party. <laughs> I'm gonna be working. <gasps> Lipstick. Oh, matchy, matchy. 
I don't have social life, so I'm staying home. There's not many things I hate more than waking up early in the morning, especially on the weekend. Today, my wake up call was 6 45. Today is my uh, workout day. I do high intensity interval training. Um, two to three times a week if you know my schedule allows it and yeah on the weekends my workouts are really early in the morning which I'm not a fan of because I can barely function in the morning especially when I work late at night I I think I've told you that I'm like a proper night owl anyway I need to head out because I don't want to be late so I will talk to you when I come back <laughs> now I'm just gonna have something to eat take a shower get ready because I'm going out for lunch today with my family and all the relatives because it's my sister's uh, birthday in a couple of days so we're celebrating my makeup is done I just did my usual um, everyday face <laughs> I've been using the same makeup products for about a year um, so I'll quickly show you which ones they are because I do really like them these are basically kind of all the makeup products that I've been using in the past year if you've been following me since my beauty days on YouTube you will be absolutely shocked probably because I've always had so much makeup but yeah now it's a little bit different i mean i still have a lot of makeup but i just don't use it i guess for my foundation i use one of these two products this is more of like an everyday cc cream that i have from herborean it doesn't provide a lot of coverage but it blurs out the skin very nicely this is the cc cream from it cosmetics this one still doesn't give you a whole lot of coverage this is definitely more of like a sheer kind of foundation that can be built up. This is the setting powder. It's from Rimmel, the Stay Matte one that I've been using for years. My go-to eyeshadow palette is the Naked Petite Heat from Urban Decay. And these are basically the shades. Hello, mister. This is what I use for contouring. It's the sleek contouring and blush palette, I guess, in Fair. The product that I use all the time, as you can probably see, because I've hit pan, is the contouring powder. If I travel during the summertime, Time. I also use this as a blush and this is a highlighter but during the year I actually prefer another blush it's this one from Tarte it's called Exposed the shade and the blush itself is called the Amazonian clay 12 hour blush this is how it looks like it's just a very nice kind of neutral shade on me these are my favorite concealers which you can get um, in my online store I'll have it linked down below it's called destinationpretty.com or .si this is just the regular under eye concealer it has a nice salmony undertone i have it in the shade natural and i have a lot of problems with redness so this is what i use to conceal my red patches i guess um it's just the green corrector another product you can get in my online store is my all-time favorite mascara ever since i discovered this one i haven't been using any others it's the best lash extreme mascara by Jordana. And then for um, an eyebrow pencil, I've been using this one from Hourglass. It's called the Arch Brow Sculpting Pencil. This is the shade Warm Blonde. I did really enjoy it, but now it's a bit like stubby. I don't know how to say it. It's difficult for me to like make thin strokes. So I've just repurchased one of my also all time favorites, Catrice Eyebrow Pencil. And on the lips, these are the three products that I've been using most in the past year. This is like my everyday one. It's just like a very nice, sheer, moisturizing, tinted lip balm, I would say. It's called Lip Glow, and it's from Dior. And then these are my two favorite matte liquid lipsticks. The first one is from Kat Von D. The shade is called Ludwig. And the second one is from Jeffree Star, and I have the shade Mannequin. It looks like this. If you are looking for a cheaper version, Golden Rose actually do really nice liquid matte lip six as well i have a few more but this is my current favorite it's like a really nice dark and shade 20 they don't have a name but yeah they do really nice liquid lipsticks as well now it's time to get dressed i'm just gonna wear this super basic jumper like gray dress because i've just realized all of my jeans are in the washing machine <laughs> another day another super early morning look at those crazy under eye circles oh. i have to take benji for a walk and the situation outside is not ideal I don't think you can see it, but it's literally raining cats and dogs. When your sister makes you breakfast for the first time in a decade. <laughs> Is this cocoa? Yeah. Is this a special kind of cocoa? Yeah, with mom and dad. I'm just working today. I have these two buddies here with me. Boy, you're rearranging my bed. 
the ultimate chill pose. <laughs> I really hope you guys are dog people as well otherwise you must be super bored watching my vlogs because it's all about Billy and Benji over here What's up Katya? Mm. I'm tired From what? Sleeping? <laughs> I'm school right now. Okay You excited for tomorrow? No Why? It's my Days on this earth are numbered. <laughs> My life is cheating away. Says that at the age of 22. Wait till you're as old as me. <laughs> oh. By the way, it's my sister's birthday tomorrow. No excitement whatsoever. Usually you're like, it's my birthday. It's not my birthday yet, so maybe I'll play that tomorrow. Shut up. Yeah, I'll play that tomorrow. We shall see. <laughs> Happy birthday! I just rolled out of my bed. I haven't even brushed my hair yet, so I do apologize. But yeah, time to give my sister a present. I'm not sure if she's gonna love it or if she's just gonna be like, meh. Also, half of it hasn't arrived yet. I ordered it three weeks ago and it's supposed to take a week, but it's still not here. So she would just get like an extended a Christmas present in a few weeks. Anyway, let's go downstairs. Close your eyes. We come in. Don't peek. <laughs> <laughs> she knows me. What is it? It's the 1975s. Oh, I thought it was like a price thing and I was like, oops. <laughs> oh my god. Amazing. Okay, good. I this thought is I would continue. I thought I would continue the tradition yep. of giving you, you know, vinyls. <laughs> this is my favorite one. Yeah. My favorite album. Thank you. Yeah, welcome. <sighs> Today I'm keeping it chill because it's my sister's birthday. We'll be doing some fun things. I still need to do some work, but it's a very different kind of work. I need to do lots of research for a project and lots of brainstorming so I don't actually have to sit down. Well, I do, but I don't have to like be stuck to my laptop all day long and like do copywriting and editing or whatnot. So I brought my laptop to the living room and we will be watching 1975's uh, Ziggit performance. Yeah, and probably the rest of Ziggit performances as well. Ziggit is a festival in Budapest that my sister went to this year and is going to next year. I haven't been, but I really, really want to go to a festival um, next year. I'm thinking of going to Lisbon. There's a festival, oh, I forgot how it's called, Nosa Live. Uh, I don't know how it's pronounced. Um, but basically, I really want to go see Billie Eilish. She's one of my favorite artists um, and she's performing there. And then I also saw that there's Taylor Swift performing there a day before, which is a bit of a weird mix, everyone says. It's like two very different kinds of music, but I do enjoy both <laughs> and I want to go see both. So now I just need to find like a travel buddy that's gonna, or like a festival buddy that's gonna come with me because I'm okay with traveling alone, but Music festivals, I don't know, I can't imagine them being super super fun if you're there on your own. But yeah, that's on the cards for next year and I really hope it works out. Before the groomers, <laughs> okay, back, back again. <laughs> Billy, you look so funny. You have a helmet haircut. I'll give it to someone special. What you doing? Baking a uh, baking. muffin. My sister is celebrating her birthday again today because her boyfriend's relatives or family, <laughs> they couldn't make it on Sunday. So she's throwing a separate little get together at our place today. So she'll be making Nutella muffins. Mm -hmm. And what else? Prosci Prosciutto rolls again. Prosciutto rolls and <laughs> pizza rolls. And With ham and cheese. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And just regular platters. Oh yeah, with like what are you eating? Dried meats and cheese and stuff.
All right, it is time to finish this vlog because today I actually went on an adventure here in Slovenia that I'm gonna make not a separate video about, but it's gonna be featured in the next video along with all the shenanigans that will be happening over the weekend. My sister and I are home alone this weekend. My parents are off to Finland and we'll be putting up the Christmas tree and everything. So you'll see all that in the next vlogmas. But before I say goodbye, I also asked um, my Instagram followers whether they would like me to do a Q&A or a um, your assumption about me video as like one episode of vlogmas. And pretty much everyone said yes. And they have already submitted me some questions and some assumptions about me so in case you do not follow me on instagram i'm giving you the opportunity to ask your question for like a random q a in a comment down below or you can write down an assumption about me that you have and i'm gonna let you know whether it's true or not i'll combine the two videos into one basically and yeah you can ask me or give me your assumption on absolutely anything and i promise i won't get offended uh, if it's something more personal i don't know yeah that's everything i want to say i hope you enjoyed the second episode of vlogmas and i'll see you with the third episode very very soon bye about to leave already packing come with me i'm not really asking